think I read one review of a season three review by a British magazine that I will never read again, and I won't even say their name. And they accused Lance and I of phoning in some episode around, which would have been like around February when it's pretty bleak and you've been doing things for a while. And I was so angry because we never phoned in, not a second, not a heartbeat of that. We were so there, like Lance was just, as an actor, he creates such a circle of respect. People are gonna do their best. You know, there was deep things going on in our personal lives that we connected with and I was all alone up in Vancouver and it was raining and he'd been there two years and knew how that grind can go. It's a long grind, like nine, it rained from October, no, November 1st to April. And I didn't believe sad existed, like sudden, you know, that you could get depressed or dark while working on a serial killer show 14 hours a day. I was like, why, I'll be fine. <laughs> and he would say, the despair, watch out for the despair. You know, I feel like it was really based on like chemistry between Lance and I and like what happened once we met and it went really well. <laughs> we, it was a good fit. We were, it was a good fit.